I generally focus on the brain and brain development um, and kind of anything that falls under that. So clinically, I really look at uh, assessment of children and their cognitive profiles or neurocognitive profiles and then help make their school settings something that's amenable to that. I like to do things like healthy eating and um, help build behavioral skills in their kids as well and then help them learn and grow in a way that promotes brain development too. And then I also tend to look at what happens when the brain doesn't develop very well. So my research actually focuses on uh, brain injuries and concussions and looking at how those kids go back to school, what their recovery profiles look like, and then also neurobiologically, what they look like and if we can find some biomarkers for that. I think most of my work is interdisciplinary in nature and I think as a neuropsychologist that's one of my key focuses is how can we bring medical and biomedical and biomedical engineering even in with psychology and neuropsychology in some way. So Water Your Child's Brain is another great project that we work with the pediatric club and the pediatric clinic here. Really pull together families in the community. We had um, nutrition talks from our faculty here. Um, we talk about sleep and wellness. We help parents figure out what kinds of things can we do based on the science that's are really gonna make kids' brains grow better. The environment has a huge impact in the way that our brain develops, so if we can tailor that environment to promote brain health and wellness, I think that that's gonna be a really interesting area. And I think we also have, for kids whose brains don't develop the way that they're supposed to, uh, we can then improve those outcomes for kids.